Hi everyone, welcome to a new video. In this video, we will talk about CART AI Control Net. So, as you know, CART AI is a platform where you can create AI images like text to image. And the Control Net is a feature there with the help of that, you can use some reference model and create your images. So, to access this, first you have to get to the website of CART AI. Make sure you have already logged in or maybe you have registered yourself on this platform. Once you're done with these things, you will see its interface and a lot of different art pieces created by people there. You can also use them or maybe create your own from the scratch. For that, you have to simply click on this generate option and you will get here. So here you can just simply have to give prompt and it will generate images from it. If we look here, we have this option control net. So what happened here is that you just put an image here. It will gather all of the information from this image. And after that, you will give prompts to it and it will generate an image from your reference image, but with also the inclusion of your prompt. Let's say you want a room like this. You upload an image of a room and then you will do some of the changings in prompt and then it will generate a new room based on the reference image. I have selected this model now I'm just going to select an image from my system. Here I have selected this image and now this website is doing that it is creating a prompt from this image. In the prompt it will explain like the body language, overall looks of the person. And if I want to create another image for it what I'll do is that I will do the changings into that prompt. Let's say it has explained what kind of a person is standing here. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to change its race, some of like its color, background and other stuff. And once I do that, it will work onto that prompt and will generate an image which will be very similar to this image. There will be a person who will be standing exactly like this. Its body pose will be exactly like this, but its race, color and some of the other aspects will be different. So this is what control net do like if you want to create an image you will put it there and it will gather all of the information from that image will create a prompt and in the prompt you will do some of the changings make it according to your preferences and then you will get an another image so once you have done looking at the prompt and now you have done customizing it just simply enter it and then it will work on to it and once it's done you will see the result so here you can see it has generated an image from the prompt that I gave it. So here the person is doing the same pose as the picture I gave it as a reference. I did some changings in the prompt like I told to change the race of the person, change the color shirt, change the background and some of the other things. And it worked really good on the prompt and here are the results you can see the difference between the reference image and this image. The poses are the same but the things I told it to change are completely done very well. So you can also use this control net. You just have to choose any model of your choice, upload an image as a reference there. Then it will take out all the features from it, create prompt from it. You have to do the changings in that prompt according to what you're looking for. And then just simply press enter key. It will just hardly take one minute and once one minute passed you will see the results and once we get back there you will see this image so if you want to upscale this image you can do that if you want different variations of this image you can also do that in case if you want to delete this message you can even delete this message so this was all about c art ai control net here we learned how we can use this feature and i'm Pretty sure that you have understood very well that how you can use it to create more images and i also hope you found this video helpful and informative if you have not subscribed to the youtube channel then make sure to subscribe it for more informative videos and updates and i really appreciate you watching the video till the end thank you so much for it